All right, welcome back to Foundation. So I'm outside the castle walls, looking at the superstructure on the inside, and I am waiting impatiently for them to get done so that I can continue designing the different pieces. I'm also trying to ramp up the tool production and, uh, of course, keep everybody happy. Uh, let's turn on the user interface here. Now, I've been running at speed, too. Yeah, and um, no, I'm keeping it all, okay? Um, and, oh, some sheep farms are getting complete. I forgot that I built the sheep farms. And we've got a few unemployed that I'm going to assign to builders. Um, the happiness is sitting at 92. And we've got 320 berries, 220 cloth, 522 bread, 1,000 shirts, clothing, sorry. 477 wheat, which, I don't know, we're making bread and we're not even using any of the wheat. It's crazy how much wheat's being produced. And I believe it's all because the flour is uh, being produced so much faster. But our flour is low, which this tells me, if look at the flour at six. If we had another windmill, uh, we have even more flour. Um, so I'm going to probably add another windmill. And then iron, yeah, we have three and tools. We only have six, but tools are still being used for this. So if I click on this, uh, Grimer's bringing five tools. Duncan's bringing 20 tools. And Constantinatius is assigned to the construction as well, but he doesn't want to bring anything. Um, and you can see we're at 435 out of 650 stone, 62 out of 162 tools, 0 out of 10 planks. So I'm going to let this run a lot and uh, just take care of business while it's going on because I really want to design more. And I don't want to hit start this episode, but I want to get some more designed and uh, get another build going by the end of the next episode. Um, and then decide at that point, because I think the next build is going to take a long time. So at that point, I think I'll start uh, ramping up the polished stone production so I can get a monastery going. Hey, it's a trader dude. I don't, there's no warehouses over here. Ah, uh, there's warehouses over by the keep. Yeah, let me pull out. Yeah, he's, so he's going, uh, okay. So he's going here, over here, down here, around here to go over here to go to these warehouses that don't have anything in them. Could have just taken a right turn, dude. Don't quite understand why you're taking that path. But I don't have any uh, crazy... Nope. Yeah, I don't know. Don't know. But, oh boy, look. Uh, so while I was gabbing, uh, these front pieces got completed. And the back pieces are still being worked on. And the center piece is still being worked on. Which uh, comes up on... on joins the two edges. But, yeah, that's a lot of stone. No problem, though. We have 2,561. And you know, I'm telling you what's going to happen right now. If I get to 4,000 stone, you can't stop at 4,000 stone. If you get 4,000 stone, you got to get 5,000. And then if you can get 5,000 stone, why not 7,250? But then if you can get 7,250, now you gotta, you got to be asking yourself, so what do you think if I had 10,000 stone? Is that going to break the resource list? Not that I want to break the game on purpose, but I'm curious. Can I get 10,000 stone? Should it be a personal goal to have 10,000 stone? I haven't decided yet, but I might. But then some of this stone's going to have to be turned into polished stone. So, um, you know, and this place is just a swamp. So, uh, you know, producing all these goods out of what was a vast wasteland of water and bugs is a good thing. To, to a king, anyway. You can see here that the two uh, iron smelters and the two blacksmiths are still under construction. And, uh, but I do have these high prioritized. Otherwise, um, they weren't getting any workers because, or builders, because the builders were all doing something else, working on the church, most likely. We also have a lot of houses being built. And I am just simply assigning builders right now. And I'll search for these builders later. But they're all builders until I decide what to do with them. And, uh, wow. Did I talk that long? I guess it's speed too. You add a lot of people. You know what? I've done the mass population thing where I had 1,500 villagers. I think 
that right now anyway, I am going to pause the um, immigration. Okay, one day. Okay, I'll pause immigration after this next round uh, until I can sort out what to do with all the new people that are added. Um, because right now, um, I don't really have any place for them. And uh, are they are they coming in? Two new villagers are joining your village. Okay, so I'll turn immigration off and then uh, turn it back on once uh, once I have definite places for them to go. Um, I did also assign somebody to this warehouse, a builder. And because they can do stone. This one was going to do wood. Where are we at on wood? 245? This one was going to do stone. Okay, Duncan, where do you live? Right, you live over here. I can see the warehouse from here. Therefore, it's close enough. I, I can see everything, okay? But it's not that far away. Right? Anyway, uh, guess what, man? You are, um, you are assigned to this warehouse, stone. You don't have very long to, to go to take the stone. And then, you know, am I having sec- Oh, Oh, Delina, where do you live? You also live over here. Okay, you're no longer a builder. You're assigned to this warehouse. So, that is... Oh, don't close that. Why, why do you gotta do that? And what about this? Is this stone down here? Alright, one more. So, Thine, you should live with Oh, Delina, you do? And so, you're no longer a builder. You are... In here with the transport, you're here, and... Oh, we have building complete now. Okay, good. The two smelters are complete, so that's fast. I forgot, speed two is fast. So, uh, I don't think I'm gonna find anybody on this list. Nope. Um, so we're looking for villagers who are close. Alicia! Where do you live? Uh, wrong side of the world. So let's skip you and Alfled. And let's go up to Pleasance. Pleasance, where do you live? Uh, you live over here, and that's good. It's not ideal. I wish people... People are building in here, though. All right, let me scroll down to the bottom. Tomlin, where are you moving in? Where are you moving in? You're moving in over there, too. I think I might just have to wait, because I see new houses going up, but I don't see who's living there. I don't think. Is this rebuilding? No. Uh, the capa the house is the capacity is high, but it got built before anybody moved in. Really? So should I let two more people in? Okay. Two more people. Two more, and maybe they'll move there. Cause look, we have another house here. Right? I did not realize that houses now got built before we had people to move in. That... That is something I did not know. And hey, the wooden bridge completed. That was this one. And it's working. Uh, it wasn't that one. It was this one. Which is also working. Good. The trader's crossing it now. So, alright. And the boat successfully navigated under it, even though now he's standing in the boat. Uh, and he got his head chopped off, but it's okay. Um, let me extend this wall now, because the bridge is a little shorter. So the wall will extend to right here. And then, uh, I didn't want to do that. And then this will move a little bit. There we go. Right? Let's not spend a lot of time on that. But, uh, yeah, the wall. Look at all these houses, would you? Look at that. Look at that. Look at all the stone. These stones are starting to collect pretty good. Yeah. Uh, we only have 2,800 stone, though. So, obviously, we need more. We have two new villagers joining. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and turn off immigration again. And we'll see if they move where I want them to. Whoops! I missed these two. And where did you move? You're still... Oh. No, you're still moving over here, which is not bad. But, uh, what about the empty houses, uh, over here? What about these empty houses? We have two empty houses over here, and I... I was not aware that that could happen. I thought you moved in, you requested a house, the house got built. Now we're building houses before we even have people to move in. 
I'm astounded. Don't I sound astounded? Alright. Oh, maybe what happened is, is that two people moved over here, so these are now vacant. That could be. Which is fine. But I just need people to move in so I can assign them here. Alright, fine. New plant. Well, first off, find this guy really quick. I missed him last time. Click. I'll deploy my troops. Open mission set. Try not to get stuck this time, you rook. Whoa, wait a minute. Lavin, you're not a rookie. You the one that got stuck? Uh, isn't that interesting? All right, don't get stuck. Open this. Nobody gets stuck. You hear me? Anyway, what was I saying? Oh yeah, the uh, last two that just immigrated uh, moved uh, over here. Okay, so... So, the heck with them. Uh, but we're gonna run out of berries, of course. Because all these new people moving in, what do they need? They need berries, and they're gonna flow through. Berries for a while, and then bread or fish. And uh, two more are joining. And so, I'm gonna fall behind the berries unless, you know, I get some builders assigned. So, we're gonna have to go through the builder list. And uh, your home is... where the heck are we? Yeah, not you. So not you two, not the A's. Then Pleasance, I swear I viewed your home before. You are over here by the sheep. Talk about getting turned around, easy. Uh, right, you, you Pleasance, um... You're gonna, you're gonna become, uh, berries. Uh, here. And, yeah. There you go. You're in. Um, and then that gathering hut is full. And this one needs one. And, uh, let's see. I'm ignoring the A's. Evelot. You're also over here. That's good. Uh, let's zoom over here. And you're, yeah, you're going right here. There you go. So that's very berries. And then I have three berry huts over here that I can ramp up. You know, how long how long do I want to wait? Okay, I've got to ramp up the tools, so I'm just biting the bullet. Even though they don't live close, I'm biting the bullet and saying, you know what? Uh, forget it. You you are um, you're an iron smelter, and whoever lives with you, uh, which is Pepin, I believe. Uh-huh. Um, you're an iron smelter as well. Okay, so that fills out that one. And then, um... We have this one to fill out as well. And... Mathilla, where do you live? Two new villagers are joining. Okay, well, so much for turning off immigration. If I could just get some villagers out here, uh, I need one in the iron mine. And hey, we get one free territory. All right, I'm gonna save it for a while. It, like whenever I'm going to just leave the game running for a while, I can't, I can't put it down. So this is what's happening. I'm not putting it down. Instead, it's like, wait, this is a good time for another because look at flowers always low. Let's put in another windmill because we can definitely, we definitely have people that can, that can work the windmills. And uh, we can take out a couple more trees here and put you right here on top of the hill, like so. And just like this, that's a good spot. And uh, I'm gonna high prioritize you just for the heck of it. Even though I, I did steal a lot of builders, but um, you know, you have, a, you have a pretty nice view of the town from up here. For one thing, maybe that steeple's a little too tall. This is hiding uh, the monolith there and uh, 2001 Space Odyssey monolith. Um, but this is a pretty good view. Can I get in the, can I hop in the trees? Yeah, top of the hill, it's like you're picking berries and stuff. And then you've got a heck of a view of the town, which is slowly moving into the distance. And uh, the big castle, which should fill up this entire scene at some point. Yep. Uh, and you know, somebody else mentioned, um, Oh, the treasury's up. So now we can take $8,200. But somebody mentioned in the comments, Hey, 
uh, these things look like grain towers. And I completely agree with that. And, you know, you could put them like over here near the uh, granary and I mean, we'll use stone, but what the heck, right? Um, let's just edit that really quick and say, right, I want a uh, stone, just a treasury. And, oh, that's right, because we got these little treasuries. So we're already, we can already pop over here. We go up, you know, it's kind of like uh, silos of grain, right? And we could put them like in between the warehouses, like in a clump here next to the church. And, uh, you know, just lift them up a little bit. There. Yeah, some grain silos right there. And I don't think that's going to block anything. So let me wipe this out and wipe this out and wipe this out, wipe this out, wipe this out. That's all I put up, I think. Yeah. And yeah, those will just sit right here. Let's get those started. Start. And uh, no rush on the construction of those guys. Hey, fetching. Fetching is assigned to construction. Well, fetching, you better get something. Right? Uh -huh. uh, so how are we doing over here? All is still good. And we need about 120, 118 stone. We still need 70 tools and 10 planks. And somebody's bringing 50 stone. So it's not going to, it's not too bad. And while I was doing that, we have uh, Hunfridus. Uh, where's your home? Oh, you're over here as well. Wow, that's just grand. How many flipping houses are over here? Same with uh, Colblaith there. And Elisant. Um, you're also over here. Great, and everybody's moving. It's time for everybody to move over here. That's fine. Whatever. Move over there if you want. I don't care. Um, and then tools. We have 109 tools. Good for us. And you've got seven. Okay, that's older. You've got three tools here. And you've got two tools here. And we do have one warehouse that is collecting tools. You've got 50 and 7. I could start... Oh, did I... Um, how did we get 15 tools here? You know what this means? This means that because we're buying tools, I'm buying 50 tools if we need it, that the trader stopped by and sold us 15 tools. But now we don't need them anymore, so this won't happen. That's the only way something could get in here, in my opinion. Anybody close? Nope. Uh, oh, we have a builder. Wolfgar the Builder. Congratulations. You're going to be stocking this warehouse, so you'll be competing for the tools. Any builders over here? Yeah, you can find the builders. Coalblaith. Uh, you're in the windmill, and, um, uh, Tootbertus, Tootbertus, I think I pronounced that correctly, it's Tootbertus, uh, you're right in there. I don't know what Tootbertus means, but, uh, you know, that's what it is. And two new villagers are joining, man. Uh, if I can get these flower numbers up, I'd be happy. Because the wheat's just ridiculous. It's staying constantly at 468. And the farms aren't overstocked with wheat yet. But our warehouses can only hold 400, right? Yeah, 200 apiece at each warehouse. And 50, 50, 50, 50, 50, 30, 40, 30. Yeah, we could really use to use more wheat. Thank you. And shirts are hanging at a thousand still. And we're rocking with 3,136 stones. Alright, the uh, castle is threatening... Phase one of the castle is threatening to uh, finish here. Uh, we've got 10 of 10 planks now. 70 of 70 tools. Now it's just a question of a builder showing up to uh, put the parts together and get it done. And, ta-da, it's done. The, the monolith is complete. 
Let's look at it. Um, that doesn't look too bad. Roof does show in the back. But, um, right. And uh, how many people can this thing hold? 68! Oh man, all that stone for 68 people, but it's because it's only the it's only the, the space, the square footage at the bottom that counts. Not the entire square footage all the way up. Um, but yeah, we've got people that decided to go to this. So anyway, I can now start adding on, but you know what? Uh, it's been hours. <laughs> and hours at speed 3. Let me slow it down to speed 2, actually. Although at speed 3, we were able to stay at uh, 92, 93 happiness. Uh, so I'm very happy with that. I did turn off immigration, though. Um, the other thing that's going to happen here is that they're going to run out of trees to cut. And when they do, I'm going to start converting some of these woodcutter jobs into different jobs. Uh, possibly warehouses. Or the berries over here is another good one. And check it out. Remember I put, uh, I put people in here and told them to collect stone? They have. And we're now rocking 4234 in the stone itch. And that's not bad. Kind of hoping we get to 5,000. But um, we can easily get to 5,000 eventually. Right? So, yeah. Um, I said that I was going to start building onto this. Unfortunately, no. Um, I'm out of time. But uh, let me find a good place to uh, end this. Alright, I like this spot. Um, this is at the end of what was the long straight road. The church is here on my left. The hedge is right here. And if you look way down there, you can see all the way almost to the Little Lord Manor. The, the road kind of curves off to the left there. And so you can't really see around the corner. But you can see pretty far. There's a lot of people in this village already, although they are crammed into this area. Um, but yeah things are going well and uh, you can hear the money the the money making machine that is all these markets um or you could well she just bought clothes but anyway right that's gonna be it for now uh and when we come back i promise that i will have some of the uh castle parts constructed and ready to go because there's no sense in showing you know, me positioning everything. Instead, we can see the plan. And then uh, I'll be deciding if I, uh, you know, what I want to do to get that building. Um, and definitely, I mean, you know, part of the fun is expanding the city. So we'll definitely continue to expand. I'll turn immigration back on and uh, start expanding our food and such uh, next time. All right. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you later.